won't your advice be to Mark Zuckerberg as he deals with the fallout from Cambridge Analytica? I've uh, known Mark since he was 20. He's uh, before his drinking age. Before he was drinking age, I invested, of course, in 2005 and joined the board. It's exactly 10 years ago uh, that I helped recruit Sheryl Sandberg uh, to be Mark's partner at Facebook, and I have full confidence that Mark and, and Cheryl uh, will do the right things and I hope be very transparent and very open on a consistent basis with the worldwide user base and that I think has always been historically a hallmark of Facebook and now more than ever I think big technology companies such as Facebook, Google, Alphabet and others uh, really could step it up and be much more communicative to all constituencies uh, in the world we live in. My personal view. So you think that as long as a big tech company has a founder, a visionary at the helm, then it won't suffer from big company disease? What I've seen in this generation of the FANG stocks, Facebook, Fang Apple, and Amazon, Netflix, Google, and of course Baidu, Alibaba, these are great companies. Tencent, uh, watching the stock price get hit the way it did last week, I truly believe long term Tencent is one of the world's extraordinary companies, as is Facebook, as is Amazon, and largely because the founder CEOs are so driven on not letting big company disease enter into the company, not becoming bureaucratic, and I advise many of the startups here in China, as well as the startups in Silicon Valley, and the young founders find ways to partner with the Mark Zuckerbergs and the Pony Ma's and the Jack Ma's because that only allows the young companies to learn more, build scale faster, and build something that hopefully endures the way some of these companies endure. Now, a venture capitalist friend was telling me, and some other friends, uh, buy some bitcoins, hold on to them, <laughs> and just, just leave them there. And then others say, um, you know, banking friends say, they're worthless. Um, what are your views on cryptocurrency and blockchain technology that supports them? Well, I'm a very big believer long term in blockchain technologies and many of the underlying cryptocurrency technologies that are being developed. Uh, in fact, uh, one of my earliest uh, digital currency investments in 2013 is a company, Circle Internet, where I brought in later the IDG China partners and friends, and it is doing extremely well focused on blockchain and underlying cryptocurrency technologies. Uh, it's very hard to predict which coin is the right coin long term, but I'd really like to bet, which I am, smartly I hope, on Chinese companies and US companies that are very deep technically, that are building tokens and applications on top of the blockchain and pursuing long-term opportunities in digital payments and financial technology.